spanning the globe to bring you quarter horse racing news as it happens. Uh, you got a big announcement to make to the quarter horse racing world. Yeah, you know, uh, <laughs> I don't think it's really all that that great of a secret. You know, a lot of the horsemen actually know and all, but my plan is to the end of this year to, uh, you know, to, to get away from being a jockey. I've got uh, some other business interests that I want to get involved in and a few other things I want to do. and. Uh, it just seems like the time's right, you know. Uh, I don't, I don't see that the time's ever going to be perfect, but uh, I just uh, analyzing it the last couple of years and all. My my plan is to uh, is to hang it up at the end of this year. You know, uh, there's, you know, when when you know monumental milestones and things like that happen, it always makes you reflect on, you know, where you got to where you're at, how you got to where you're at, and then all the people that helped you and. You know, I could I could go on and name just a, a tremendous amount of people, and uh, I just there's there's so many people I normally leave someone out, you know. And with you know with the with the prolifer proliferation of social media, the internet, you know, it just seems like guys get so much more exposure than we than we used to, or, or maybe even we deserve. And uh, of course, the A and E search has been just a tremendous asset to the quarter horse industry and they've really done a lot for jockeys he sp supplies pants i know he's probably getting some some good cheap advertising but uh you know they they do a lot of great things to uh to promote quarter horse racing and that's that's uh that's what's made my living and everything i've got for the last 30 some years that's that's what i've been all about and uh there's nobody that's been luckier or had had a better run than i have and i'm i couldn't be more fortunate and more lucky